Yo, the boys and girls, howdy ho, peoples. Today we are playing the Royal Chaos and we have gotten Worgen. We have gotten Rogue. Rogue, not Worgen, my bad. Rogue. The reason why I said Worgen because I'm uploading the Worgen video and I completely spaced out. I'm not coherent yet. Uh, on the left side we have Sorok. There's a gold mine and there is a workshop. Sorok is being played by Diadon. It's 100% Temple Guards. Diadon will play Temple Guards. I can bet my butt and like, you know, sell my organs. This guy will play the thing. The, 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 the Temple Guards, yeah. Funny enough, I'm actually not losing the lane against him terribly because I have minus two armor. But I feel like he also has minus two armor. Yeah, so I'm gonna play hero items. This is my best and like the highest win rate uh, foundation for the rogue. Maybe it's a little bit repetitive, but I don't care. It's it's good. On the right side we have solitary angel. There is a goblin observatory and lumber mill. These are like fighting neutral buildings. This one is economy and base protection. And in middle we have Draenei by Syntec. So far, we know foundation of one person. It's... Hold on, actually. Yeah, I got upgrade on the left side. <coughs> and that is foundation of Solitary Angel. He's playing Fnatic. Fnatic has, I feel like, a Breath of Fire or something like that. So it has, like, a... You know, a cone of fire. If I'm not mistaken, yeah. I'm pretty sure that's his foundation. I might be wrong, but likely it is. It's kind of sus here, like... <clears throat> it does have bonus damage. I feel like it has, like, extra attack rate. And uh, minus uh, range. Yeah, see? Breath of Fire. It's like the equivalent to my casters on damage. And they have just a little bit more HP. Um... Armor is because my rogue has minus two armor, so I have more armor. The other one did not upgrade the barrack on me. Fascinating. Uh, for Draenei, it's a source of magic. That's a no-brainer, yeah. So he can cast his spells uh, twice, like, or three times. Not, not twice. It's minus 12% three times, so 36% faster. He can cast his spells 36% faster. Plus, he will have unlimited mana regeneration on his main. It's pretty safe and boring way to play the game, but I mean, who am I to judge? I feel like it's good. So the only fun person's foundation that we don't know is uh, Diadons. And like 99% sure, I am 99% sure it's going to be the Temple Guard. I've seen Dia play it like a billion times, and it's really damn good, so, yeah. I'm gonna skip the damage upgrade. That is very counterintuitive for Rogue, but I have to. Because I really want to my units to have a bit more armor. They start like with zero armor, right? And like, you can see like the value of armor, it's very good. Like, it's very, very good, so. I'm also gonna create like a bigger wave on the right side. And help help me push on the left side. So I don't really care for damage as of right now. And yeah, Diadon is playing Temple Guards. So there we have it. There we have it. Um I would say Diadon is playing meta play, uh Syntax is playing meta play, and then Solitary Angel is playing decent one, but I don't feel like it's dealing too much damage. Yeah, I feel like Breath of Fire right now deals like 50 damage, and you can see like Sorrow Casters already regenerated everything, so. Yeah, like it's it's good, but it's not good enough. Like it damages you, but it can't kill you. Does that, does that make sense? That's how I feel about it. Anyway. Um, we got two armor upgrades, so now my melee units have at least 11 armor, tier 1. And 17%, you know, damage reduction on tier 2. 7 armor. So, yeah. It will generate this wave to be a little bit, you know, more resilient to dying. See this guy not dying for quite some time? Yeah. I'm gonna get a caster upgrade because magic damage and caster stacking is one of the key to pushing lanes. 
Casters also die death, explode. Oh, I see. Yeah, I didn't know about that. Die at death. <laughs> yeah, true. Casters die at death. Yeah, you know, shit is crazy when casters die at death. That's the foundation that to be feared. <laughs> Normally casters don't die at death, and then, you know, these ones, they do. Kinda of sassy, but whatever. Uh, the only zero to upgrades, one caster upgrade. We are just... Like... Lost siblings. Not a lot of siblings, I would have got like, you know. Two siblings that haven't... Like, yeah, I uh, don't know. Uh, two brothers from different mothers or something? I don't know, dude. Because he's playing exactly the same way I do. And even for him it's more justified because his damage is pulverized from temple guards. My damage... I don't have pulverize. So, yeah. What's up, Minus? Damn Zoom, I'm late today. What's always up? Where is the war in the Black Lands? Me and Motion negotiated, and I'm gonna play Dark Ages of Warcraft. We already played World of, World of Warcraft Arena, and we have already played 8-bit um, rate. I'm gonna play it a bit more, though. And, uh, yeah. I'm gonna get, like, maybe 2-2 two, two upgrades, and I'm gonna contest middle with my tier 3 barrack. Uh, total gold, we have Syntec leading with top 1, and then Diadon is top 2. I wonder why Diadon is top 2, because he's, he can test at middle. No. Now, I guess he got his neutral buildings on... Ah. On Syntec. Fast. I know. Now he is one free upgrades. Sorry, there is zero free upgrades. It's gonna be a deadly push. Diana is very strong. It's very hard to even pile up units here and start pushing back. Rough. It's very rough. Hmm. No one really did go for the fortress. I mean, like, a uh, mercenary. Not a single person. Research-wise... Syntec and Diadon have the most. Alrighty. So now with the tier 3 upgrade, right, tier 3 barrack, we, we have gotten this uh, Pegasus Rider. Pegasus Rider is an air unit that benefits, guess what? From damage upgrades. So, yeah, from now on, so I, I feel like early armor is good for any race, it's important. It's important that you withstand 400 damage AoE spells, so your casters don't die, don't get one shot from it. Otherwise, it's very, it's very easy to defend, right? But after that point, I feel like damage is more important, because usually it upgrades, like, you know, it's cheaper. And it, it helps you contest middle better. I summoned 5 units, maybe it was over too much. But my units are very cheap. So... So you always have to estimate, like, you know, how many units do you need to defend this wave? How many units do you need to defend this wave? I'm gonna aim casters. All my buildings have uh, siege damage, so... I have to buy one more. I miscalculated. I was so greedy. I could close my eyes and say that Syntec would also contest middle with tier 3 barrack, and I was right. He did. So, yeah, that, that that's like, you know, you don't need to have a brain. 
it really felt like he would. It really felt like. Um, he is free for upgrades. Now, the real question is, should I go to for barrack mid? And I feel like it's a very unsafe way to play the game, so I'm not gonna go for it. A tier for barrack on mid. The raid denies you possibility of going hero mid. It really denies you the possibility of getting higher upgrades. And someone like if Solitary Angel would go to Barrack on me, I would die, likely. So I feel like taking is a bit safer. I don't know why, but I feel like it's gonna be a great, great contest on middle. I'm very happy the guy didn't aggro on the right side. Sometimes AI is that dumb. It is that dumb to aggro on the right side, so. Alright, Tim. <clears throat> I'm very dorky with my uh, tower upgrades when I play Rogue. I usually don't go for anything but Inspiration Aura. Field upgrade is like armor plus your units can get items on kills. I don't think it's that good. Early on you just need damage. You have zero LU spells. Zero. You only rely on this value of damage being high. If you don't have it high, you lose the game. So I feel like Critical Strikes are good. Inspiration Aura is good. Polymorph level 1 is decent. That's for sure, but yeah. What's think about my replays is they seem to use spell on max range. That's kind of bad. Well, they are, they have 300 range of attack, so yeah, they. That that I feel like that's pretty bad, yeah. Um. Animal watering is also not the worst, by the way. The worst, the worst. Plus six damage is like 10 percent. Right now. I'm gonna get one level in Polymorph. The thing is, the moment Sinta gonna summon a hero, I'm really considering summoning my assassin. I live to serve all believers. So I have no idea chat if it's yeah it's syntax hero. Well in that case, middle is everything I need and everything I have, so I must summon a hero now. Double hero mid. <clears throat> I need to kick out any contesters. I'm playing with the hero items. He already got boots of agility. Oh my god, dude, you are so dumb. Uh, we need to max out damage now. This guy needs to, like low three, low two for poison, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, low two. It is, right? There you go. And he poisoned him. Now Wellon gonna be assassinated. Let's go for Inspiration Aura. So basically I'm gonna play around heroes. And what is best for the heroes to give them extra damage, right? So I'm gonna play, I'm gonna be summoning billion heroes and giving them damage by inspiration aura. I'm gonna try to attack to tier 3 fast. Mental of intelligence, okay, my heroes are trolling me. They like, it's, it's not even trolling, it's like BG. <laughs> <clears throat> I might over push, but the earlier I summon my heroes, the better it is. Any old war training. Around 10% damage, 25 HP. Mm. Yeah, I actually went 6 3. I would imagine he would go 3 6 because of Valorize, but no.
Okay, Jay is very strong. I can't out push him for quite some time. And that's annoying, to say the least. My bounty hunter over pushed. Never mind, my entire lane over pushed. <laughs> it's fine. No, it's not, but whatever. What can I do? Yeah, now we're gonna get inspiration or level 2. So you see now, the higher my damage, the more I benefit from this high percentage of bonus damage, right? It seems to me that Syntag does not even care about summoning his own hero or anything like that. I mean, yeah, he can't actually summon a hero because I will just kill it with my bounty hunter, so true that. See, total gold. Uh, we have the most, but we summon two heroes. So you can imagine it's not the best case scenario. Now we're gonna go 4 for upgrades on everything. Left side is very suffering. I had to buy already 15 units. The good thing is that rogue units cost 3% less. So it's not as bad. They don't have some most, Syntec has the least upgrades. I wonder why. What is that that Syntec spent his gold on that he has the least amount of upgrades? Isn't that at least a little bit sus? Can't tell ya. So once again, like yeah, I, I went for Inspiration or level 2, Polymorph level 1. Uh, field upgrade is decent. Okay, now he summoned his hero. Oh, he got poisoned! Will it kill him? It might not. But he will be very low HP. Um... Let's summon three casters. Okay, this Breath of Fire now is actually dealing a lot, yeah. I was laughing at it, but in reality, yeah, it, it hurts now. Okay, this is actually serious. I bought all my units to defend against this. Yeah, Solitary now is strong. Actually strong, so yeah, I, I know. This is not... No laughing matter. And I don't want to summon my hero, because it might over push too fast. So I want to defend like normally. Dude, okay, I was I was joking about this Breath of Fire before. <laughs> it is destroying my casters. And even the problem, if I in, even outpush now... The next wave gonna damage them even more, and then the next wave gonna damage them even more. I feel like all these casters are gonna die. I cannot push the add-on either. <laughs> okay, it's good my casters right now are far away. The hex helps a little bit. Just a smidge. <coughs> uh... Hero killed. Okay, I didn't kill a uh, Syntax hero, unfortunately. In two minutes, I'm gonna be able to summon my... In two minutes, I'm gonna be able to summon my hero and meet again. <coughs> yeah, Rogue is weak. Guess what? R Rogue is actually weak. I have eight, eight four upgrades, double inspiration aura. Like I can't, I can't push these guys. Like they, they just they're beating the shit out of me. Like what else can I go for, right? Tier four upgrade plus tower upgrade. Upgrading polymorph will not really help too much. I feel like getting one level is fine, but like getting more levels is like eh. Um, inspiration aura level three. It's very expensive. One point four. 
thousands gold full of free inspiration aura uh, chance to block an attack for tier 1 range and tier 1 melee tier 1 range doesn't need that i don't like it uh, critical strike for tier 1 and tier 2 melee it's good but in the same time you want to stack like range range damage right melee damage only matters like <clears throat> on side lanes but even then like doesn't do too much because your melee units die too often uh someone here someone someone the hero somewhere annual war training is good but i feel like mostly like one upgrade and then you want to probably wait until you have tier 3 barracks so you, it applies to two units i like this a lot flat damage and flat hp is good Blinding dust for tier 1 units, it's a stun, it's not too bad, and then for tier 1 units you also have tier 1 melee. You can <coughs> summon a... what item do you get? Uh, not too bad. And then you can get like poison, yeah. Poison is good, I always like poison. Like poison in any form. In Soraka, Chaos is like very decent, yeah. Oh damn, Solitary has a tier... Yeah, his uh, main building being very damaged. <clears throat> my, my logic is also, if people gonna upgrade their barracks on me, tier 3, right? I will not follow it. Instead, I will summon my heroes to defend, so my heroes can level up. Because I'm playing Hero Foundation, so I need to do that. <clears throat> and yeah, let's finally attack. The, like, there is, I feel like there is no point to save up, like, you know, one, like 2.5k gold plus something else. And only then, then attack. For example, you want to summon the super unit as a surprise. Right? What you can do, you can save up enough gold for both tech and super unit. So, like, you know, people don't see you being tier 3 and then boom, you, you do both things at once. But I feel like the problem with that is you you're gonna waste your mana a little bit and then when you upgrade you don't have too much mana it's basically the concept if you upgrade your hp by 1000 but you are missing 500 you gonna le have less hp when you have full hp then you get the hp upgrade does that make sense it's basically like if you have a mana potion, right? It's much better to like drop all your intelligence items and like mana items and then drink the mana potion and then pick them up again. The same thing here. You wanna like, while you have mana, you wanna attack and then use mana, right? So, so I feel like taking faster is, it can save you like 50 or 100 mana at least. Mental of intelligence. Oh my god. I mean, I can keep it for now. But yeah, ideally I will sell it. I mean, I will forget later on. Fuck it, I will sell it. The logic behind that is that stat items are only good for completing... Uh, low free items. So, you really don't want to have it. It stops your progression item-wise. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm very afraid of uh, push on the right side. So I might actually summon the Geritos. I hope he will not push too, too fast. But yeah. I'm rushing my T-Free Caster upgrade. It's very important to get it. I can, I can imagine Diadon will get it soon. And Syntec also gonna get it soon. So yeah, T-Free Caster upgrade is my only source of AoE. The only source of AoE damage for me. I don't have it from anywhere else. And now we're gonna max out uh, damage upgrades ASAP. I feel like max out damage upgrades, get probably armor to low 7, and then we're gonna max out masonry. It was some dorky plan, but usually it works. The moment the other gonna get his, uh, by the way, um, low free caster. I feel like I'm done though. <laughs> like, <laughs> I keep on buying units. It's pretty bad, but like, I can't do anything. He's just that strong. It's a Rallying Cry 1. Poison low 3. 
6x upgrades on everything. It's giga broken. What item do you get? Why all my characters are getting mental of intelligence? Oh my god. Like, dude. It is a catastrophe. Like, literally everyone is getting the bloody mental of intelligence. You're a strength hero. And you don't have a tier 3 item. You don't need it. Okay, so literally Angel went for the mana shield. That's very interesting. Okay, honestly, I'm tired of his bullshit. I bought 39 units. 39 units. And I also bought 4 heroes. I'm gonna fall behind on upgrades so much. If I, if I don't, like, do anything about this. So I'm gonna go tier 3 barrack. Enough is enough, dude. I have tier 3 caster upgrade, I have lots of damage upgrades for my air units. <clears throat> oh damn, if you use... If you use some mana drain on the camera, the game may crash. That's what I used uh, before. Is she knew about it? No way. Yeah, I didn't know about that. Usually, a uh, mana draining illusion makes illusion being dispelled immediately. You piece of shit, I can't get items. Dude, this is crazy. How in the world is this happening? That's so why you can make sure your fortress never dies with his knowledge. <laughs> Okay, my items being garbage. Just hot garbage, this game. Nothing but complete trash. And yeah, we have 11 upgrades on damage. Look at this Pegasus Rider. Like, that is... Quite, quite OP. Okay, we're pushing the other one. Did he get the caster upgrade? Tier 3. Yeah, okay, we are doomed. The tier 3 caster upgrade on Sorok summons a Serpent Ward with 90 magic damage. 90 magic damage. If you want me to call it, I will. It's bullshit. <laughs> See this thing? Actually, 80, 84. Yeah, it's 82 average. I mean... Kinda almost 90, but yeah, not quite there yet. Uh, Solitary Angel has 6 7 upgrades. Still didn't get a third caster upgrade. I guess he didn't tag, yeah, I feel like he didn't tag. Got uh, 4 upgrades on Masonry. Then got 2 upgrades and then Syntag. Actually, Syntag has the most. He already, yeah, I feel like Syntag is bunkering up. So we need to play aggressively. I need to. Level up my siege tower a little bit. So we're gonna summon it on mid. Uh, well now. Until he gets his third caster upgrade, I feel like I can probably beat his lane right now without using Garitas. On left side though, I have no idea. Yeah, it's gonna be a gamble. I'm gonna get my final upgrade on damage. And yeah, so. That was my logic of my build, right? I'm very focused and built around heroes. And my units give damage order to them. So you can see this. Yeah, plus 100 bonus damage. For my uh, super unit. I think mean, it's pretty good, yeah. I think it's pretty good. Here we will have to buy all my units. Let's buy casters. And probably Tyrone Mary, and that should be enough. My casters have shockwaves, so... Should help. I like how they cast it one by one. I don't know if it's the most efficient way to do it, but okay. <clears throat> Finally! At least one hero in my army knows how to do items properly. And not get stat items. Likely my super unit gonna be stuck for a very long time. Like, very, very, very long time, so... I do not expect it to 
lift the middle until, until like smite it or like like other super unit is going to come in. I really need uh, inspiration aura low free. It, it's like range is being increased. And yeah, it's pretty strong. Uh, I'm very scared of the add-on. So I might summon a hero of mine. Yeah, I need to summon. There is no way I will, I will defend with Solar Rise. Plus, I'm gonna get more items. I summon my heroes to raise six times. Six times. Which is not ideal, but yeah, what can I do? Okay, it's getting. Hellstone. Yeah, not that exactly items, exact items that I want. We're still losing to Solitary Angel on the right side. I very struggle to defend to defend this. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, researches. Yeah, we have the least. The other one has the most. The other one already has nine on ranged. I was thinking this might my super int on mid. Okay. Uh, sure thing. Okay, I'm gonna summon then. Did he summon his super unit meat or not? He didn't hear the sound exactly, so... I guess I'm gonna summon my hero meat then. Other one. It's like something needs to be on the middle for me. I need to be dominating middle. This is the only way I can be relevant in the game, so, as a rogue, in my opinion. <clears throat> so, I guess his strategy is basically is going to be, I want to cast Smite a billion times. So, he has his foundation is uh, better casters, but also he has more mana regeneration on his main. So his strat is gonna be like, you know, I wanna just be casting uh, Smite a lot. Can you stop spamming heroes? Okay. Uh, before I go messenger now, I feel like it's the best timing. Dude, my Garethus is dying. Dude, like, what the fuck? It's a tier 3 barrack versus tier 3 barrack, but his is so much stronger. I am losing. Even with a hero. Yeah, I wonder, like, who's winning. I feel like Sintek right now is, like, in a very good spot, yeah. But I feel like people realize that, so that's why his uh, side barracks were so damaged. I don't know. Another Sobi Mask, Lemao. I know, right? You need a critical strike, though. Yep. Critical strike is very good against evasion. Because you can't you can basically wait when you have. Uh, when you land a critical strike, the person cannot await. Uh, the Soro has evasion. So, there is that. So we have two tier 2 items. And that's about that. We don't have anything else. It's pretty much man. But yeah, what can I do, man? I can't do much. Okay, my super unit actually is available again in 4 minutes. And Gerthus died. PG. Uh, I'm gonna research ultimate weapon so I can see the situation on the middle.
I mean, no situation in the middle, like a uh, situation around the map. That's what I meant. Um. Okay, so. Syntax is highly damaged. He smited my hero. I feel like the only one who is not damaged is uh, the add-on, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I know kind of the way I want to play this game. So Solitary and Syntax are tearful barracks on each other. Syntax and the add-on are tearful barracks on each other. Uh, for Frabra, it's just full of smite requirements. I feel like they're so busy fighting each other. Like, they really can't pay attention to me. <laughs> and that's, that's nice. I feel like that's very nice. Yeah, I definitely will summon a super unit mid. I feel like ideally my hero will die. So my super unit is gonna get stuck and start farming levels and items. Yeah, but I feel like that's not going to happen. Uh, here, I could summon a bounty hunter, but he will die. I feel like this is by far like my only option. Like, jokes aside, I have to upgrade Barak to tier 4. Or I will lose it. Like, it, 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 it's that simple. Like, Sorok is 99 upgrades. He is a uh, giga strong. I have nothing on this. Nothing. It's my only way to play it. And he still might beat me. It doesn't matter, like, he, he, he still might beat me, you know, like, it's just, he is that strong. See? Like, Jesus Christ. Do I need to summon Jailer? Jailer Kassan is better than Assassin for holding waves. So I guess I could have summoned him, but I don't know. Maybe now I can stabilize. You also went here for Barak on me? Okay, I need Kassan. Again, he's getting all the dorky items. <laughs> yeah, like, I don't know. He can't combine an item now. Oh, man. Heroes are so stupid. Okay, Solitary Angel went tier 3 Barak on me. That is asking for Garethas. Yeah, they are very delaying my super unit meet. It's hopefully cooldown already soon and I don't have gold for that. Yeah, research wise, I feel like we are giga behind. Yep, the other one is 50 researches. We have 37. <clears throat> yeah, Belt of Strength. Like I said, Belt of Strength is only combined with the boost of agility and amount of intelligence, which is very hard to get, almost never, like, possible. And then, it also combined with the tank item, but he has only one ingredient, tier one ingredient for the tank, so it will never, ever, ever combine. Ever. Yeah, I think it's being pushed a lot. To be honest, I could have nuked his buildings right now for... Like, you know, but like, I know, then the other one might win. Solitary also, like, you know, is not dead yet. It's looking decent. Uh, you know what? I might need to be back on the right side. Yeah, like, I, I'm struggling here. I don't think you're gonna be holding this. Eh. How many mercenaries do you have? Four? Five. Five. Okay, I, I, I need to, like, I need to launch Inspiration or Low Free. I feel like it's the most important upgrade I have. After that, I feel like Critical Strike is, like, solid. Uh, like, two for meat. Is also a good idea. What else is a good idea? 
animal war training right now is looking in my eyes. I feel like it's a very good upgrade too. It's even more damage. It's all about damage for me. Okay, we're gonna pick uh, Inspiration Aura. Yeah, so I think he's actually like losing a lot of HP on his buildings. A lot. Like, the other one is putting... Oh my god. It's like... He's putting a lot of work. Yo! Okay, okay. There's two more hits on this gun. Damn. Okay, I need our upgrades. Let's go critical strike. I guess field upgrade now is not the worst. Guys, this is dying. You stupid fuck, why are you dying? Um. You gotta duplicate? Can you complete one item, please? You're level 21, you're an embarrassment. To the whole family. You're already 21 and you have not complete a single item. What are you doing? Oh my god, dude, my heroes are actually inting. I, I, I haven't gotten a single level 3 item. On any of them. Sometimes I had like, level 4 item on low 10 hero. <sighs> Didn't know Gareth so well, I remember him being really hard to kill. I feel like it's a late game and like, people have 9-9 upgrades. So, yeah. Okay, any war training. And... I can just go Messenger 4. Yes, either Messenger 4 or... I think Supreme Meat though is better, yeah. I need Supreme Meat. <laughs> now we're losing to Temple Guards. <laughs> Supreme by Solitary Angel. Seems like immediately smites. Immediately. Hmm. I don't really have enough for a Supreme still. That's a problem. I wish it wouldn't be, but yeah. Mm. Oh, screw it, I can do it. I'm your support right now. Come on. Come on. I'm on! 20 gold! Stupid game. <clears throat> Would you cancel? Annual war training? It might not go to the, to the left side. Please go to the left side. <laughs> Kek. Uh, uh. <laughs> no! Dude! This game sucks. 
I'm pushing Solitary Angel that has already has seen enough and yeah. At least 14 floor elevator got a good item. 5% attack rate on this aura. I mean, come on, it's very good, yeah. We have maxed out uh, Inspiration Aura 2. It's pretty good. Mm. Can I defend it only with Gerritus and Bounty Hunter? I feel like I can, yeah. Yeah, please tell me you are getting good items. Mantle of Intelligence again. Dude, are you like, you wanna be smart or something? Like, huh? Like, why? <laughs> why you guys are doing this to me? Can you get like decent items? upgraded mid uh, to tier 4. Should have done it like a while ago, but yeah, never had gold. The other one is on... yeah. His base is... untouched. So I can't pick an ultimate weapon yet. I'm messing with the AI so it aggroes on towers time to time. If Gareth survives, it's gonna be huge. Nope. This abomination killed both of my heroes. I should have bought units earlier, I think. Meanwhile, my 13th floor elevator doesn't even think about dying, like, ever. Okay, we need um, annual world training, critical strike level 2, field upgrade level 2, and yeah. I think these are the most important upgrades, I don't feel like there is anything else. And yeah, I if I'm afraid... Solitary is dead. You still have my heroes, they're just, wow. I don't even get gold from uh, pillage anymore. Salvage. Zero. Hmm, I do want to summon. <clears throat> Always getting F by smite. So they're gonna be a big wave from the middle, coming to me soon. Um, I guess I can't summon Super Unit to the other one yet. Like I really can't, like, I have to play defensively now. Um. Question is like how many heroes do I need to summon? I feel like one. Probably just one Cassand. And he is getting dumb items again. Like he can't combine metal of intelligence with anything. He can be combined with the sorcerer, but he has one item for sorcerer only, so. Okay. 
I didn't notice that uh, Syntax summoned the super unit on, and fell on him, so... Yeah, a little bit delayed, but here we are. Get here for Barrack. 9, 12 upgrades, he's maxed out. Yeah, we still have like two upgrades on armor, one upgrade on masonry, and two upgrades on range damage for buildings and demolishers. Um, oh, we are tier 3 on, on the right side. Yeah, me tier 4. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. In tier 4 here. Yeah, Dia will defend effort effortlessly against that. It'd be hard against my super unit though, but... Yeah, I feel like... I, I wish I, I summoned uh, Gerthus right now here on mid. And I summoned uh, Kassan plus super unit on... On top. I feel like that would be better, likely. Yeah, nice, 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 nice. Huge. Okay, now. Okay, don't reagro, I guess. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, here I will need to summon the bounty hunter. Actually, no. I might need to summon Gerritus, rather. Yeah, Gerritus is gonna push this lane better way. Okay. Um, yeah. We need to play safe now. From now on. So I'm gonna go Mercenary 4. 6, I mean, Mercenary 6. Yeah, my super unit now is uh, got here, dude. They are killing each other and I'm staying out of conflict. Being chilling. Finally, he found an item! It's just, this is my first tier 3 item at minute 52. Sometimes I get this like at minute 10. Oh my fucking god! Hallelujah! Bro, it took me like so long, such a long time to get the item. Like, holy cow. Um, bam 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 bam. I feel like I need just, yeah, probably annual war training. Shredded round, shredded rounds are not too bad. Because my siege units, they have colossal damage, as you can see, so yeah. Backstep. We must need like better experiment Ariagra on to the side he needs. Uh, let's go gunpowder. Another low free item. Tank. To be honest, you need it probably the least on the super unit, but. Will Dia don't go for smite? Will Dia don't go for the mana shield? What will Dia don't do? He's not summoning super unit. He might actually do it like last second right now. Who knows? Yeah, we have plus 8% attack rate though from uh, lower tier items. So that's pretty good. He also got the low free item, Brawler. Yeah, look at that. All my heroes are getting items. Finally, after like such a long time. Honestly, dumbasses, like they're absolute dumbasses, dumbasses here. Yeah. yeah, doesn't want to kill his hero. Yeah, it's ignoring his hero and aiming like air units and shit. Yeah, that's kind of annoying. 
<coughs> he's seen like a scammy with the Naru. I have to pick ultimate weapon. Yeah, is refusing to pick ultimate weapon. <laughs> yeah, this is like an ultimate, no ultimate weapon run. He is very stubborn, like, yeah. <laughs> Holy cow. Okay, we have um, finally nine upgrades on armor. It's not the most needed thing, like I said. I mostly like damage, and I need damage. Okay, you have one HP, dude, and you still didn't pick ultimate weapon, all right. God, it took him so long. <laughs> Why didn't you pick ultimate weapon? People are like very stubborn. Yeah, like they 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 really refuse. I've lost seventy bounty hunters the entire time. People refuse to pick ultimate weapon. Like defensive one towards offensive one. I know why. Because I wouldn't be able to defend anyway. You would! What do you mean? Just like, yeah, use mana shield or use the smite. And like, you know, try to like, just hide in the bush while we, me and Sintaka are killing each other. No. That's what I would do. I would play for my win, right? And how can I win? I just, you know, have to sit low. And, you know, just try my best to survive. Every hundred second cooldown on all heroes. Receive well, and if I smite, Del. Well, if you... If you smite exactly the moment when he did smite you, so his super unit deals zero damage and has zero impact, I think it might be the best, no? You can still do shit. I know. The fountain of mana on any side that I have conquered. No, there is no fountain of mana on this map. My Garethos, my bounty hunter are dying. What upgrade am I getting? Actually, I'm getting zero upgrades here so far. Oh, Gareth is still alive. His heroes are something else. Even though my heroes has, uh, have items. Yeah, he's uh, like not dying. Whatsoever. Okay. Yeah, we just need like uh, 15 mana. No, we need 20 mana, my bad. We need 20 mana and then we have it. How many resources do you have? 57. I'm the lowest in the resources. I have everything maxed out here, but yeah. In tower upgrades, we still have animal war training, field upgrade. I think I need to summon super unit so he doesn't smite me, because like he has mana soon for smite. Let's see. <clears throat> so I'd rather have him waste his mana right now. And so he doesn't have it again when I summoned for the third time. Third time the charm. 
Now I might not have enough gold for it in time. That's a problem. Hmm. I'm very curious. If I summon Cassand, can he assassinate Adol? Adol. Let's find out. Smart so cost and ultimate weapon. 125. On mine. Yep. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of I I got up. I thought it can kill it. I thought my low twenty five Cassand, you know, can do shit, but yeah, I guess he can't. <laughs> Stupid Cassand. Yeah, whatever. I could have saved 5k gold for winning the game. What do you mean? 5k gold gonna give me 200 mana. What are you talking about? I already shot twice. Slabek? Yeah, I already shot twice, like, so I wouldn't be able to do anything extra to it, so. This thing is like unkillable. Like, what the fuck is that? Like, bro. Just kill it, please. Just kill it before Gertes dies. Thank you. Okay, GG. Cool game. Yeah. I feel like the only strength of Rogue is uh, their heroes. Like, that's the only thing I have. I, I don't have anything else. Like, I had all upgrades that are important for damage, right? I couldn't match his units. Not even close. Time for Warner Plaguelands. I will never ever play Warner Plaguelands. Shut the fuck up. Thank you.